the Nobel Week was a unique experience in many ways. I mean, it was like being on cloud 11 for the whole week. And a lot of, uh, lot of publicity, of course. It was, on the one hand, the Swiss made, uh, actually, as I mentioned before, they, we had 24 hour coverage, essentially, by uh, the Schweizer Illustrierte which would then make very long reports on the whole, send pictures to the space television every day and so on. But in addition, there were two Japanese laureates the same year, Tanaka and a physicist whose name I cannot recall right now. And so there were of the order of 140 Japanese reporters here and Tanaka was mostly locked up in his room because he was completely overwhelmed and uh, the physicist was much older than I and he, uh, he also had to be very low-key and because I was ra I'm rather well known in Japan, you see I just got the Kyoto Prize, they, uh, they, they have videos of me uh, which they played on television. So the Japanese reporters started to come down on me when they didn't have access to the Japanese laureates. <laughs> so it was a very intense week. And, uh, but it was, of course, it's the greatest week in a scientist's life, I think. I may also add that I have been back three times since, and it is much more leisure and much more eating and drinking uh, when you are here as a visitor rather than when you are a laureate. <laughs>